Hello everybody, Cindy here with Monarch Mom DIY. Today in this short video, I'm going to share with you, first of all, a recap of some of the photo albums that we've been making in some of my paper crafting videos on my channel. And then I'm going to share and do a review for you of a product that was sent to me that will complement these photo books perfectly. And that is this photo printer by IDPRT. This was sent to me and I'm going to show you how to put it together. It's very quick and easy. You can print photos wirelessly or with a cord directly from your phone or computer. So let's get started. So as a reminder, here are just a few of the photo books that we've made on my channel here. We've got some flip out books and if you're interested in any of the tutorials for how to make these books, please let me know in the comments and I will send you in the right direction. So we've got this landscape one. We have this junk journal that we've been working on. This is made actually from a graham cracker box with a twine spine here. We've got lots of goodies in here to fill up. And then we have our card uh, flip book that we made using the base of folded cards from places like Hobby Lobby or Michaels. So it's super fun to make the books, but what makes it even more special, especially if you're giving this as a gift, are adding photos and journaling to it. So let's open up the photo printer that was sent to me and I'll show you just how easy it is to set up and use to start printing photos right away. So this is the Ziva 1966 from IDPRT. It is a photo printer. It comes with everything you need here in the box. In this box are the AC power cord that plugs into the back of the printer. It also comes with a USB cord that you can print pictures from your computer. Next here, we have the actual photo printer. Very well packaged, I will say. Everything is very secure in the box and nothing was missing or broken. Now this small box here that's under the printer, this contains the paper tray and it also had a package of photo printer. Now my printer came with the ribbon already in the machine, but sometimes that might come separate. And I'll show you where you would change out that ribbon as well. So the quick start guide is very easy to follow. Here you've got your power button. Here is the side door that has the ribbon cartridge. And then here on the front is where the paper tray goes in. Also the USB plug is on the front as well. You can see, oops, right there on the left. And then in the back is where the power cord plugs into the printer. So let's get this plugged in. You're just gonna plug that into the back of the printer and then plug into a wall or electrical outlet. Hold the button down and the power will turn on. Now this works with an app called Hey Photo, H-E-Y-P-H-O-T-O. -E and if you search the QR code there, it'll show you where you can download it to your phone. I already have it on my phone, so I'm opening it up and it's really easy to connect your app to the printer that you have. Next, I'm going to show you where the ribbon cartridge is. Like I said, if when you're ready to change it, it simply pops out with that little button and you can pop another one back in. Next, we're going to load the paper tray. You'll open this front tray, and all of these are very clearly um, given these directions in the Quick Start Guide. You're gonna open this first flap of the photo paper tray, and then the second one. Load your paper in the tray, and then close just that second flap, and you're going to insert it into the front of your printer. Once you have that paper tray in, you'll see my power button goes from red to green. 
Now on your app, you're going to click search device and it will look for your device. Mine is already connected. So then going back, you'll click on photo. It'll open up the photos on your phone. You can select the one you want to print. I'm gonna print this one here of my two daughters at my younger daughter's show. Click print, it'll get it ready, and then it'll say, do you wanna print it? And you click yes, and it will send it through the Wi-Fi to your printer. Here you can see when it's flashing, that means it is printing. What's really cool is you'll be able to see the take up the paper, and then you wanna make sure you have room on the front and the back of the printer because the paper will come in and out as it does four different passes to get all three colors and then the final film over the top. And here's the final product of our picture. It turned out so, so good. It does have these little perforated tabs at the top and the bottom. This is because that is where you want to hold the um, photo paper before it is printed so you don't get any fingerprints on it. Then you can go back. You can also do multiple pictures on one sheet. So here I'm gonna select a few different pictures and then once I have my four pictures selected, it's going to give me different layout options. So here's the default layout and then there's other options at the bottom. You can also click on pictures and either drag them or click and rotate them resize them and when you're ready to go you hit complete hit print yes and let now it will print all four of these pictures on one four by six sheet of paper So these pictures I've all printed wirelessly from my phone. There is this cord that will connect your printer to your computer if you so choose or your phone directly if you don't have a Wi-Fi. And then once these are printed on this photo paper, you are safe to cut them and trim them down to size. Thanks again so much for being here and for watching this short video. 
I am giving two thumbs up to this photo printer. Every picture I've printed directly from my phone or wirelessly has turned out so beautiful. I love the quality. Um, and also one other thing, I don't know if you could see on my phone, it does the yellow, then it does the magenta, then it does the cyan, and then it does a plastic, non-plastic. So it's a plastic free, but it's a covering. It's a film covering that makes your uh, pictures a little bit more water resistant. Um, it keeps them from breaking down from, it's called anti-oxidation, also anti-fingerprint and dust proof. So I'm loving this photo printer and thank you to the company for offering a discount code for my viewers. So that will be linked in the description of this video. Thanks so much for watching everybody and have a great day. Bye.